Hello students, this is the fourth video and the last video of chapter number 12 of Falling Leaves from the Real English book, Falling Leaves written by, sorry, uh, the poet's name is Margaret Cameron and poet's poet uh, uh, in the uh, Margaret Cameron has described the scene of typical autumn season where the old leaves fall down as the wind blows, sick leaves and old leaves of yellow, red and brown color fall down as the wind blows strongly, you know. So strongly wind blows during the autumn season. It seems the uh, as a though falling leaves are saying goodbye to the all uh, to the new leaves. And in the second stanza, also I explained to you that the poet talking about sweet leaves which never be again green again. They never be green again. And um, from they are falling from the different uh, trees. And in the third stanza, I explained to you that the old leaves which are fallen. Uh, down by overnight and have taken a shape of carpet and in the fourth stanza I explain you that uh, the poet talks about cruel winds that it takes uh, um, the sick leaves uh, with itself and uh, that covers and it seems like that is uh, uh, frightened from everything the leaves the old leaves are frightened from everything and they as a result running away from everything and in the final stanza in the last stanza all down the stream on its shallow tide float the leaves like ship in which fairies ride ships uh, that hasten to harbor and shy winter is coming goodbye goodbye now in the final stanza the poet says that the all these leaves head towards the river head towards the stream head towards the river on its high tide on reaching over there these leaves float like ship float like ship which are boarded by by fairies which are boarded by fairies it seems that these ships are hasting towards the harbor are talk are taking a deep breath harbor are taking a deep breath and are announcing the arrival of winter clear it they are announcing by the winter is coming uh, and announcing the arrival of winter winter is coming so clear Thank you.